Ladies and gentlemen, this is a knockout crunch match. It is scheduled for one fall. Introducing first, accompanied by Velvet Sky and representing the beautiful people from Toronto, Ontario, Canada, Angelina Love. You just about had it up to here with the beautiful people. It's hard to believe that two people that look like that can cost you that much Pain, you know what I mean? They just irk you. They just got this way about them. They're just too good for everybody else. Pain, mental anguish, absolute embarrassment. Just ask JB when they gave him the brown paper bag treatment on impact. Well, that's why you and I try to avoid them as best we can because we want to make sure that bag doesn't come over here. We got nowhere we can run or hide connected here to these microphones. Boy, when it comes to the background of these two TNA knockouts, and wow, what a great close-up look that was of Angelina Love. I think I totally lost track of what I was going to say about Angelina Love and Gail Kim. As and this is definitely Velvet Sky's best side. Probably just best if you and I lay out and just take a look. You know, pictures worth about to from Tampa, Florida, Gail Kim! Maybe the most proud of the TNA knockout. Don so happy with her accomplishment when she became the first ever TNA knockout champion. In my mind, she's the one that put the knockout division on the map, certainly cemented over the course of the past six plus months by Awesome Tom. But initially, Gail Kim, and look at Angelina, Cheap shot attack from behind. Well, opportunity. We heard Angelina tell us about it. Gail Kim should have been expecting that. Angelina Love says that she'll take every advantage of every opportunity. And I was going to say about Gail Kim, think about it. You talked about how proud she was to be the first champ, what it meant to her. Think about how close she was to getting that championship again. And Angelina Love tossed her from it. And she's never forgotten that. Gail Kim has just wanted to get this opportunity one-on-one -on -one with Angelina Love in front of this big crowd here in Houston that's all she's been thinking about, talking about it, and I said, you can't let your emotions take over out there, and she's like, no, it won't happen. I've been thinking about it, I've been planning it, and I mean, watch for her to just put on a clinic. She's got to channel those emotions, exactly what she has to do. Series of those open hands, chops in the corner. Angelina fired off into the turnbuckles, and Gail comes right at her with a clothesline. One thing we know, though, about Angelina Love, and the beautiful people, both of them, you turn your back on them for a second, and they'll make you pay. Gail Kim better realize, just like that, that Velvet Sky's right outside that ring, and again, she just saw one thing. She saw Angelina Love, and for a split second, forgot about Velvet Sky, and now, advantage Love. Quickly rolls her in. Angelina on the cover. Near fall only. This is what you talked about, Don. When you face either one of the beautiful people, you've got to have those eyes in the back of your head to keep that look around ringside, because in essence, you know going in that it may not be booked, it may not be signed as a handicap match, but that's what it's going to turn out to be. And look at the physical condition that Angelina loves in. I mean, she's a workout fanatic, and she's got a mean streak in her. I mean, that's that's the thing about him that just runs you the wrong way, the mean streak. But she uses that to her advantage, and you saw when she was just planting that head of Gail Kim, just trying to rattle her cage, get her confused, get her shook up so that she could take advantage of it. The fan balloting, fan voting, open at TNAWrestling.com. Another pin attempt here by Angelina. Gail kicks out. Kurt Angle, Team 3D, against AJ Styles, Christian Cage. And yes, he's back. And the War Machine Rhino. Go to our website, TNAWrestling.com, and you have the opportunity on this interactive pay-per-view to pick the stipulation. It's going to be a tables match, falls count anywhere, or is it going to be full metal mayhem? Keep in mind, anything and everything goes in full metal mayhem. And you can see the pin attempt by Angelina Love and Gail Kim, though, just getting those shoulders up quick and trying to send a message that you're not close to the pin, but the dirty move by Angelina Love poking the eyes, and look at this. Ever since Velvet Sky got involved, almost thought she had her there. It's been all Angelina Love. No question. Complexion of the matchup. 
turned a full 180. Gail Kim, as she hit the ring, Don, you can really see the intensity that she had. But ever since that interference outside by Velvet Sky, it has been all Angelina Love. And she's done everything, quite honestly, but get the three count. Well, I've heard Angelina Love talk about this opportunity. She feels that, that people still aren't taking her completely serious as a knockout wrestler. Well, you beat Gail Kim, well, everybody's going to take you seriously. And this is her opportunity to shine, and she's doing it. Gail Kim, though, she's so fast, she's so quick. You're going to run at her all the way across the ring. You better hope she's not looking for you, and Gail Kim was. And that's how you stop that. Oh, and check this out, Don. Going to try and go for a figure four type spot around the ring post. Man, shades of Brett the Hitman Hart. I'm telling you, she's just pulling on it for all she's worth. Just causing the pain, trying to get Angelina Love to tap out. And again, the referee checks on Angelina Love. Velvet Sky sees the opportunity. But look at this. Gail turns it right around on her. Slams her back into the rail. I mean, that's a good move as long as you don't lose your total focus and concentration on Angelina Love. Gail, quickly, back up, perched up on the top rope. Angelina slowly makes her way back to her feet. Again. But then from outside, was that Velvet again? Oh, she grabbed the rope, shook them, and you can see the pain that Gail Kim is in. That's what happens when you make a high-risk maneuver like that. She thought she had Velvet Sky out of it. She thought she hit her hard enough into that rail that she wasn't going to make it back in time. Velvet Sky realized she had to get there to protect Angelina. Boy, these beautiful people really watching each other's backs as we see the new TNA trading card set. Quick shot there of Gail Kim, the new TriStar trading card set. As we see the suplex from the middle rope and the impact right there as Gail Kim crashed on the canvas. How about that display of strength from Angelina Love? I mean, that sends a message not just to Gail Kim, it sends the message to everybody in the knockout division that she has a lot of weapons. She's got so many in her arsenal, and I'll tell you, Gail Kim is just, I don't think she's got anything left here. And I mean, at the last second, she got the shoulder up, and I mean the last split second. Gail able to avoid the three count almost miraculously. The series of times that Angelina has had almost the three, missed with the kick that time, and Gail answers, caught with a clothesline, then dropped with that time, another lariat, and there's the drop kick. As soon as Angelina got to her feet, that drop kick was right there in her chest. And now, Gail Kim scoops her up, but look at this. Angelina Love rolls her over, two. Wow. Gail just barely kicked her out in time. Oh, and then just charges across and spears her down. Angelina must have had a half, and half a dozen near falls. Velvet Sky quickly drops down. Keep your eyes on Angelina when you turn around. You can't caught right in the gut with the boot. Oh, well, she's going for the lights out there, but she's not able to hit it. As you can see Gail Kim cracking her with those elbows. She knows how devastating that move is. And wow, how about Gail using the knees perfectly. Angelina Love reeling. There it is, that handcuff neck right where she used, Mike. Just nip ties her down. Got on her leg hook. Three counts. Here's your winner, Gail Kim. To me, this is an important victory, Don, for Gail Kim. I think it gets her right back on track in the TNA knockout division. You look at this division. It's oh, come on. Well, the blind side by Velvet Sky, and I guess we shouldn't be surprised by it. I was going to also say it's giving Gail Kim some closure, but no more. It's now getting personal. It's now become something beyond what it was earlier. Exactly the case, and just when I was going to talk about Taylor Wilde turning this knockout division upside down with that huge upset on impact, you saw Velvet Sky come right in, and here comes the brown paper bag once again. Well, they may not get the victory, but they're going to try to end it with the humiliation as they've got Gail Kim and now setting her up for the paper bag. The teamwork as you see Velvet Sky cracking her across the chest, flinging her across the ropes. And look at this, Gail Kim, smart move, dives underneath and says, we'll fight this another day. Ducks out to the floor, Gail Kim, hand raised in victory. On that note, we're going to send it to Lauren and BGJ with the 12-10.